Georgia Cancer Friends is hosting a free seminar for men and women that may possibly save someone's life. Dr. Levy from the Associates of Central Georgia, the guest. Here we go. We're going to say that. He's going to let you say that, but he's from Central Georgia, and he's joining me to talk about this event. So good morning to you. Good morning. And I apologize for pronouncing that. You are with? The Gastroenterology Associates. A, there we go. So first of all, we're talking about Georgia Cancer Friends. Mm -hmm. All right, so Georgia Cancer Friends is hosting a free seminar that's going to help men and women. Talk to me about Georgia Cancer Friends and who you are as a company. Well, I have not, I'm invited to be a speaker. Okay. Um, I'm not with that organization. They're a, a very nice organization. They're a support group okay. for cancer patients and their families in Warner Robins. And one of the things they do is they like to do educational programs. And so I'm one of uh, two physicians who was invited to speak next week at a, 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 a reflux seminar, acid reflux seminar. So as, as part of this cancer seminar, um, there was a relation to um, uh, actually having cancer and some of the men and women there. Talk to me about the relationship that was just so shocking to me earlier. We were talking about it. Right. Well, you were talking to me about heartburn and its relationship to, um, to cancer. And, and many people don't know that there's a relationship there, between there, that. there is a relationship. Heartburn is a symptom. The disease that causes heartburn is gastroesophageal reflux disease. We shorten that and say GERD. And some patients with GERD get heartburn. Some of those patients may end up getting cancer of the esophagus. And that's most, that's not common. Okay. Uh, most people, you know, I don't want people to at home to be worried that they have a little heartburn, they have cancer. Most people will not get cancer, but some will. And we want to, we try and do these outreach programs because if we can identify people who may be at risk to get cancer, we can intervene earlier and then we can prevent them from actually getting cancer of the esophagus. And that's the message here, making sure you catch it early. Catch it early, identify people who may have risk factors, and you know, see an appropriate uh, uh, specialist, appropriate physician who can you know, treat the disease and um, you know, hopefully, again, deter that uh, course of damage of the esophagus, which becomes precancerous and then cancerous. Again, in a small portion of individuals, but you know, we want to help those people. So what can people expect from this event? Obviously, you're a speaker there as well, but mm -hmm. what else can they expect if they attend? Well, we're going to talk generally about uh, all nature of uh, reflux disease, um, medical management, surgical management, endoscopic management. These are uh, some new technologies that have been brought to uh, Middle Georgia in the last uh, couple of years. And um, you know, we're going to, I'm going to be talking with, uh, there's going to be a surgeon, Dr. Williams is going to be speaking about the surgical treatment. And uh, after we speak, we're going to open the floor up to questions, and we're going to spend as much time as it takes. So it's all about educating and making sure that people are aware. Absolutely. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us thank here today. You. All right. Well, if you'd like to attend the event, please RSVP by calling 953-1377. The free seminar will take place on December 9th at 6.30 p.m. at the Color Me Pink in Warner Robins. And